Hello guys, welcome to the OPL assignment video series. So today we will discuss about the next assignment uh, where we have to define, we have to create a user define exception to check the uh, some conditions which are given as follows. So first condition, okay, that is the user has age between 18 and 55. The second is user has income between 50,000 to 1 lakh rupees the user stays in Pune, Mumbai or Bangalore or Chennai so user and fourth condition is user has four wheeler so if these conditions does not meet that time you have to throw an exception there so accept these inputs from the keyboard and then throw the exception but right now first of all we'll see what is the meaning of exception so exception is nothing but a problem which generally occur when program is in execution okay so exception is what that is it's a problem which will generally occur which will arrive when you are running a program and it gives an expected result and it directly terminates your program so because of that exception must be handled and in C++ we can handle exceptions with the help of try and catch block okay so try block will test the condition first and then it will throw the whatever cause or whatever problem occurred there whatever exception occurred there and then catch block accept it catch it and then handle it okay so that we have to do here so there are uh, generally standard exceptions available in c++ like logic failure is one of the uh, system defined exception and then runtime error is one of the uh, exceptions uh, standard exception or uh, library exception or you can say system define exception but here in this program we have to define we have to create an user define exception where we will we will uh, define our own cause so first of all we'll do what uh, we'll include okay so we'll include an exception header file here because exception header file is, is gives the exception handling here or, or, or which defines the exceptions or the system defined exceptions are defined in this exception class or exception header file so this exception class or exception header file is having a function a public function that is uh, that is its name is what function so that what function we can override here and we can define our own exception so first of all we'll define a class so first uh, condition is for age so i'll write age underscore exception here and i'll write i'll override uh, i will inherit this exception class this class from exception class okay so i'll write okay why to uh, uh, inherit from or why to define this error class that is age, age exception uh, because to define this user define exception here we have to access we have to override the import function of this exception class so we can do that with the help of uh, inheritance here we can define direct class and then that direct class we can inherit from the exception class here so here i'll define the public okay public function that is i'll use const cap star word signature of the word function here and then const const So this signature I will use here. This is the standard signature which is available in exception class. So define okay override what function. Okay, so I'll define this uh, override this what function here and I'll return as it is having a character pointer. Character pointer I can uh, use a return keyword and then I can return string here directly. So I'll write here h is not between 18 and 55 okay so this i will write here okay then after that i'll define okay next function i'll define but the say the uh, next class i'll define so i'll copy and paste this code here again class definition and i'll just replace here with income 
because second condition is for income so i'll write income underscore exception then class exception then the same thing will be here just i will replace this if income is not between fifty thousand to one lakh okay so this i will do now here then again i will define third derived class for a city exception okay for city condition so i'll write here city underscore exception then in this again i'll write here i'll write here okay so i'll write here city is not chennai or bangalore or what you can say pune mumbai or pune or mumbai okay so this cause i am defining here you can see that everywhere i am writing i am returning the string means this is this cause i am defining here okay this cause i will display there whenever this type of input or this these inputs i will uh, give there okay so then the fourth condition is for four wheeler vehicle so i'll write here will exception and then i'll write here vehicle is not sorry vehicle is not four wheeler okay so this i will do okay so we have defined four classes okay so these four classes were required for first was required for age exception when we enter invalid data for age then income exception when we age uh, in, uh, give the input uh, invalid input for income values then city for city invalid city uh, input will use city exception and then for invalid wheel numbers will use will exception okay now i'll go for okay right now i'll just cut, cut and paste this here okay so now we have defined all our four classes now i'll go to in main function and inside main function we'll do what we'll create the well first of all we'll do one thing we'll create the object uh, we'll we don't need to create objects here first of all we'll declare we'll declare the variable age then we'll declare the variable income then i need next variable that is string city okay and then finally i need again will okay so these variables i need here after that i use try block okay so try catch block we can use so inside try block what is the use of try block so try block you can generally use for testing the condition so inside try block we will write that code which you want to test for exception so here i'll again display enter age okay and i'll take the input of age here after that i'll check the condition if age is age is less than uh 18 or age is greater than 55 okay so whenever i enter age less than 18 and uh, greater than 55 that time it will throw the age exception so i'll create the object of age exception class which i i have already defined there the object i will create and then i'll throw this object with the help of throw keyword okay if this condition falls okay if this condition does not satisfy that time i will display my age value age equal to h okay at this time i will display my age value okay then after the, outside this try block i will define catch block and in catch block i use exception class and then ampersand because i want to use password for reference here so exception ampersand in the e object I reference i will use and inside this 
I'll display my cause so I'll call okay I'll use you out here and here I'll call my function that is what function okay so this function will display the actual cause of my uh, exception there okay so this way I have defined the try catch block for each the same way I will define the next thing that is for each uh, income I'll just replace age with income then this variable with income then this with 50,000 and this with 1 lakh the other 1 lakh okay so after this I'll replace I'll create the object of income exception class here and I'll use IE I'll throw this object del Bob throw keyword and if this condition is not satisfied I'll display income is equal to income okay I'll display income and then the same thing I'll do that is I'll throw the exception I, I will catch this catch the exception with the, with the help of this parameter here and then I'll call the what function of that particular class which is overrided there okay so again I'll copy this and I'll paste it here I'll write here now the third thing that is uh, that the input that we have taken that is CT and here I'll write CT and here now the condition will change now so I'll change this condition now here so oh sorry the here 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 okay so here I'll replace age with income this age with income okay I'll do one thing. okay so I'll take the input of city and now I'll check whether it is between the that those given the names or uh, city names or not okay so I'll write here if city equal to equal to in double quote I'll write pune the and city equal to equal to in double quote Mumbai and city equal to equal to Chennai and city equal to equal to Bangalore. Okay, so this I will check if it is okay now. If it is not, if it is not right now, if it is not Mumbai, if it is not Chennai, and if it is not Bangalore. Okay, that I will check and then I'll throw the exception by creating the object of city exception I will take CE object now and then CE at this time I will display if it is not between that if it is between that then it will display city is equal to city ok then finally the last try and catch block I will define here and I will copy paste again the code here and in this try catch block I will write enter wheels okay and here i'll take the input of wheel now if the input of wheel is not 4 when the input of wheel is not 4 that time it will again throw the wheel exception okay so that time i'll create the wa object and that we object i'll throw with the throw keyword and here if this condition does not satisfy i'll display i'll display here i'll directly display vehicle is for wheeler okay and then finally i'll handle the i will accept the parameter here i'll accept the though that object here and i will handle it that exception i'll display the cause of that exception here okay so this way we have completed our program for the user defined exception handling here okay or to create the user defined exception we have done this program now we'll compile this program okay so the program has been compiled successfully now we will run it okay now it is asking for age so i'll enter the valid values now so 20 it is showing 20 here 
cell enter income it is asking for income i'll okay now it is displayed because it is valid input then i'll this uh, i'll enter pune intensity so it is again showing because it is valid input then I again uh, i will input four or wheels then it is showing vehicle is a four wheeler so this is my first test case where i have in, i have uh, given the input of uh, valid values here now i'll again run it and uh, now i'll try to give the values invalid values here invalid inputs now i'll give the 10 input here now it will show age is not between 18 and 55 and i'll input i'll give the input 10,000. so again it will display increase in, income is not between 50,000 and 1 lakh just observe that here at this time the uh, what function is calling there okay and the, whatever the uh, string is written in that function uh, overrided function that is now here displaying okay now i'll display the name of city bombay that is showing city is not not chennai or bangalore or pune or mumbai okay so then I'll display, uh, I'll uh, enter the six values of four wheels and now you can see vehicle is not a four wheeler. Okay, so this way our user defined exceptions can be defined. So if you are having, uh, if you are having any doubt regarding this assignment, please post your doubts in the comment section. And don't forget to subscribe my channel and also share my channel with your friends so that they will get these videos. So thank you for watching my video. Bye-bye.